everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. My name is Kristen, I'm a lifestyle vlogger, mom of two little boys, and today I'm gonna share with you what I picked my kids up for their Christmas stockings. So as mentioned, I have two little boys. I have a two-year-old and a five-year-old. My five-year-old loves Super Mario, and my two-year-old loves anything his brother loves. <laughs> so, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So the stockings I did buy new this year because I can't find our stockings anywhere since we moved. Our tree skirt and our stockings, can't find them. They should have been with the other decorations, they weren't. So I found these over at uh, my local Dollar General if you are needing some new Christmas stockings. I think they're like $5 a piece, they're cute. They're silver with um, a snowflake on them. They don't quite go with my normal decor, but I felt like overall they were pretty neutral. So that's why we got them. Uh, but let's go ahead and start off with the stocking for my five-year-old. So he has the Super Mario plush. I found this over at Walmart. And I'm pretty sure some of these things, including this guy you guys seen in the video where I shared everything that I got my kids for Christmas. So I can link that below if you wanna go check that out. But Super Mario plush is in my oldest boy's stocking. And of course, there's lots of goodies and candy, so always have to have a candy cane of M&M's. It's always a must. Uh, and then I found this over at Target. Uh, it's just like a little stick of marshmallows. My kids love marshmallows. I swear, every time we go to the grocery store, one of them is grabbing a bag of marshmallows and throwing it into the shopping cart. Uh, we almost always have marshmallows on hand because the kids always want them. Then I thought this was neat. Uh, my kids love taking baths. And since we moved into our new house, we actually have like a large soaking tub and the boys are all about it. And they love anything bath bomb, bubble bath, changing the bath water. So when I was on a vacation back in the fall, we went down to Brown County, Indiana. One of the stores had these and they are um, bath bomb confetti push up. It's like a push pop, but it's got confetti on top. I'm not sure what all is on the inside but I thought they'd have fun popping this into the water. So I definitely like to fill their stockings with bath treats, obviously also candies, but I try to do like a lot of bath stuff because I don't know about y'all, but my kids get so much toys that like they're excited about for two minutes and then they're over it. So if they can get something that they can like use up, I'm all about it. So we normally try to do a lot of like bath time stuff in their stockings that will, you know, they get enough of a supply, a little stockpile that'll last them for several months, but it's stuff they'll actually use up instead of toys that just like little trinkety things that end up under the couch, you know? So moving on, um, you can find these at Walmart. This one is Bath Fizzer, it's a little bath bomb and it's got a Hot Wheels surprise inside. Um, I'm not sure if it's got an actual car in it or not, I hope it does. I swear we got him one of these last year from Walmart and it had a keychain and he was very disappointed. So my husband picked it up this year. Hopefully this year it's got a car inside. We will find out, I'm sure. And then this I picked up at Target as well and it is a little, um, it's a sugar cookie mini bar. When I bought them, I thought they were actually in the shape of a star and they're not. They're like they're like a, a square. I don't know how well you're gonna, kind of tell that on camera. I just noticed it. So not that it matters, but I thought it was like a fun shape. They're not. <laughs> Next thing here, some more bath time stuff. And so this is from uh, Mr. Bubble. It's a magic bath crackles. So I'm thinking it's gonna be something kind of like the magic, it's called magic rocks or pop rocks, you know, that you eat and it like pops in your mouth. I think it's gonna do that, but in the bath. So I think the boys are gonna have a lot of fun with this. And then I got them a tiny bottle of bubble bath. My kids are not like the biggest bubble bath fan. They'd rather have a bath bomb that changes colors or has a surprise inside. So I only got them a little bottle of bubble bath. Occasionally they want it, but not often. Okay, anybody else's kid completely obsessed with Among Us? My child is in love. And so I found these at Walmart. Um, and they are keychains. So I thought he'd get a new keychain for his backpack for Among Us. Like he comes home with his homework papers and after he like does his homework, he flips it over and he draws Among Us all over his homework papers. 
And then him and his friends, when they're over, they're always playing Among Us. One of them is the Among Us and the other kids are hide, it's like hide and seek. But whoever's it is the Among Us. And it's constant Among Us in our house. I don't know about you guys, but my kid's obsessed. So I think he will be very excited to find this in his Christmas stocking. Okay, and then my son loves Super Mario, as mentioned, and um, he has the Mario Lego set, so I think he got it for birthday last year, and so we got him a couple little accessories to go with that, so this one is the Bumblebee suit, and then this one is a surprise pack, um, and I'm not gonna lie, my husband is equally obsessed with the Lego Mario set, he's the one that picked these out to go um, in his stocking, because he's just as interested in building the mario lego set as my son is uh, we got it for my son but i feel like we also kind of got it for my husband <laughs> so moving on to my two-year-old's christmas stocking we got him the luigi doll because you always have to have a luigi to go with mario he also has a candy cane set along with a marshmallow stick you'll notice that my kids got a lot of the same stuff um, my oldest got a couple extras because he did get the Lego toys. I may go out and get my youngest a few extra things because I feel bad. I try to get things as even as possible. I know he's too young to care and won't notice and he'll just be happy for the candies and the bath stuff. But I'll probably go out and try to find out a couple more things because I didn't realize my oldest had um, a couple of extras. So another one of those push pops for the bath. And then my youngest is, this is a recent development, but he's really into dinosaurs now. So this is a dino egg bath bomb with a surprise inside. So that one is for my youngest. And I know at Walmart you can get like $1 dinosaurs. So we'll probably go do something like that and get him a couple of dinosaurs to go in his stocking. So another bottle of um, bubble bath and then the magic bath crackles and also sugar cookies. And then these little goodies will set out next to their Christmas stockings. Normally I do a chocolate Santa in their stockings, but I found these at Aldi and they are chocolate reindeer. They're so cute and they're way too big to go in the stocking. So how adorable are these? They have different kinds. They have reindeer, snowman. I think there's even a Santa Claus. I thought the reindeer were adorable. So I picked these up instead of doing chocolate Santas this year and they'll just sit next to the stocking. That is everything I picked my boys up for their Christmas stockings this year. I hope you guys enjoyed this video hanging out with me. If you're new, I hope you take the time to check out my channel, see if there's anything else you'd like to watch. Don't forget to go check out the What I Got My Kids For Christmas video. And I hope you decide to hit the subscribe button. Come hang out with me in the comments below. I love talking with you guys. Sometimes it takes me a few days to get back with you, but I always try to respond. Give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down. I just appreciate the engagement. And I want to tell you that everything I say here at the end is very true and from the heart. I know it feels very scripted because I say the same thing all the time, but I really do mean it. I really appreciate when you guys subscribe, when you guys interact with me in the comments, when you guys um, give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down, it helps with the algorithm. So I really, really do appreciate every one of you who watches my videos and interacts. So I just want you to know that it is genuine. I know it feels very scripted now, but <laughs> I still mean it. So again, thank you so much for watching and I hope to catch you guys in my next video.